Now, before we go on any further, let's just cut across to visuals that are coming in live right now from the Indian capital, New Delhi, where President Draupadi Murmu is all set to raise the national flag and will begin the celebrations for the 74th Republic Day. The Republic Day Parade is set to start shortly. A very poignant moment. The 74th Republic Day Parade, it will now roll down the Kartavipat for the first time. Kartavipat is the revamped ceremonial boulevard from the British period once known as the Rajpat. Egyptian President Abdel Fattah al-Sisi is the chief guest. This year you can see the visuals coming in live right now from the capital. There you can see Prime Minister Narendra Modi. The 74th Republic Day Parade and celebrations are set to start shortly. President Dorpadi Murmu will lead the nation in the celebrations. The annual Grand Parade this year is a mix of the country's military strength and cultural diversity. Massive security arrangements have been made for the program with the deployment of 6,000 soldiers as part of security arrangements. The sacrifices 23 tableau to take part in this parade in as, as India celebrates its 74th Republic Day. The supreme sacrifice made by thousands of soldiers. And in a first this year, a combined there band and marching contingent of the Egyptian armed forces house, will also be taking part in this parade. Again. As I mentioned earlier, Egyptian President Abdel Fattah al-Sisi is the chief guest this year. This contingent, it will have 144 soldiers representing the main branches of the Egyptian armed forces. Armed forces. This year commanded by an Air Force officer, squadron leader, Akash Gangas. Rashtri Samar Smarak Par, Manne Pradhan Mantri Shri Narendra Modi ka agaman ho chuka hai. Unka swagat kiya, Vedivat Taur Par, Raksha Mantri Shri Rajnath Singh ne. Chief of Defense Staff, General Anil Chauhan, Raksha Rajya Mantri Shri Ajay Bhatt. तीनों सेनाओं के प्रमुख थल सेना प्रमुख जनरल मनोज पांडे नौ सेना प्रमुख एडमिरल आर हरि कुमार और वायुसेना प्रमुख एयर चीफ मार्शल वी आर चौधरी के द्वारा देश की ओर से अमर शहीदों को श्रद्धा सुमन अर्पित करेंगे माननीय प्रधानमंत्री श्री नरेंद्र मोदी
गॉड्स अंतर जन गॉड सुनो The buglers sounding the rows, and the guard commander, squadron leader Akash Ganghas, ordering salami shastra or salute with arms, marking the completion of two minutes of silence. Silence. eclipsing words till nothing is heard that's indian prime minister narendra modi at the national war memorial link read at the amar jawan jyoti soon at the celebrations for india's 74th republic day will begin where president draupadi murmu will be unfurling the national flag the republic day parade set to start shortly from now It will now roll down the Kartavya Path for the first time today. Kartavya Path, that's the revamp ceremonial boulevard from the British period, also known as the Rajpath. Egyptian President Abdel Fattah Al Sisi will be in attendance as the chief guest this year. President Draupadi Murmu will lead the nation in the celebrations. As you can see, the visuals coming in live right now. That's Prime Minister Narendra Modi with Rajnath Singh here at the National War Memorial. तन और मन समर्पित करने के बाद प्राण भी समर्पित कर दिए इन अमर शहीदों ने कैसे शब्दों में बांधें त्याग तुम्हारा कैसे भावों के समंदर को समेटें तुम्हें याद करते हुए तुम तो मुझे जानते न थे मैं भी तुमसे मिला न था भला अपरिचित के लिए क्या ऐसा भी कोई करता है हाँ तुम्हारा मेरा एक अटूट रिश्ता है हमारी मातृभूमि एक है The celebrations at Kartavya Path to begin shortly, where President Draupadi Murmu will unfurl the national flag. You can see Prime Minister Narendra Modi here. These are the visuals coming in from New Delhi, live right now. The Republic Day Parade that's set to start shortly from now. This time it will roll down the Kartavya Path. It's the revamp ceremonial boulevard from the British period, once known as the Rajpath. As I mentioned earlier, Egyptian President Abdel Fattah Al Sisi will be the chief guest this year. All our men and women in uniform. The 74th Republic Day celebrations will see many firsts. As I mentioned, Egyptian President Al Sisi is the first Egyptian leader to be invited as the chief guest for this event. He's also the first chief guest since 2020. Prime Minister a short while ago paid homage to the Amar Jawan, the immortal soldier. Flame of sacrifice, valor, and courage burns strong. Now the Kartavya Path will see appearance from tanks, guns, soldiers for the first time. And love to national pride. Leadership, they say, is not about. The annual grand parade this time. It's a mix of the country's military strength and cultural diversity. Massive security arrangement has been made as well for the program, with the deployment of 6,000 soldiers as part of the security arrangements this year. In a first, a combined band and marching contingent of the Egyptian armed forces will take part in this parade. That contingent will have 144 soldiers representing the main branches of the Egyptian armed forces. Also, in a first, only made in India weapons. Systems will be part of the parades. There will be tableau from 17 states and union territories, a six and six from various ministries and departments. The tableaus will depict the emergence of a new India through growing indigenous capabilities and cultural heritage. Also representing economic and social progress and women empowerment. 
And the grand finale, of course, will be the eagerly awaited fly past where aircraft from three forces will participate. The country's new Rafale fighter aircraft will perform the concluding vertical Charlie maneuver. Though the Rafale had been part of the parade in the last two years, this is the first time a quarter of the fleet, nine aircraft, will participate in this fly past. This year, invites had been sent to people involved in construction of the Central Vista, Kartavipath and the new parliament building. और ये दृश्य राष्ट्रपति भवन के जहां से माननीय राष्ट्रपति जी कुछ ही देर में यहां से प्रस्थान करेंगी प्रेसिडेंट श्रीमती द्रौपदी मुर्मू अलोंग विद आर ऑनर चीफ गेस्ट हिज एक्सेलेंसी अब्दुल फतेह सीसी द प्रेसिडेंट ऑफ द अरब रिपब्लिक ऑफ इजिप्ट leaving That's Rashtrapati Bhavan. That's President Rabbi Murmu with Egyptian President Abdel Fattah al-Sisi. The Republic Day celebrations to begin shortly. You can see them at the Rashtrapati Bhavan currently. They are departing for the Kartavipath from the Rashtrapati Bhavan. There you can see President Rabbi Murmu with Egyptian President Abdel Fattah al-Sisi. The Republic Day parade to begin shortly. At the Kartavipat. The Kartavipat being the revamped ceremonial boulevard from the British period that was once known as the Rajpat. President Draupadi Murmu will soon unfurl the national flag. Egyptian President Abdel Fattah al Sisi is the chief guest this year, also being the first chief guest since the year 2020. President Draupadi Murmu will lead the nation in the celebrations this year, the annual Grand Parade that's going to be a mix of the country's military strength and cultural diversity. The President's bodyguard ready to salute their Supreme Commander. President and our chief guest for today's parade will now board the vehicle to slowly reach the saluting base. The commandant of the President's bodyguard, Colonel Anup Tewari, will be riding to the right of the President's car, leading this elite body of horsemen mounted on his charger, Glorious. And to the left of the President's car will be the second in command of the regiment, Lieutenant Colonel Ramakant Yadav, mounted on his charger, Sultan. Specially placed cameras over here at the majestic forecourt of Rajtrapati Bhavan, where ceremonial welcomes are given to visiting heads of state. And today, all dressed up as India celebrates its 74th Republic Day. The official residence of the President of India. The President's bodyguard, the senior most cavalry regiment, 
carries out mounted ceremonial duties for the president and its officers and men are excellent horsemen, trained tankmen and paratroopers. On either side, tinkling fountains, adding to the air of festivity, ceremony and grandeur. And there right in front, we can see the central dome. And here we come back to Kartavyapat, where the Prime Minister has arrived at the saluting base. Kartavyapat par salami manch ke saamne agman hurha hai. दुनिया के सबसे बड़े लोकतंत्र के प्रधानमंत्री श्री नरेंद्र मोदी का चौहत्तरवें गणतंत्र दिवस समारोह के अवसर पर देश के माननीय प्रधानमंत्री का आगमन की अगवानी के लिए रक्षा मंत्री श्री राजनाथ सिंह सलामी मंच के सामने मौजूद प्रधानमंत्री का आगमन और जाहिर सी बात है बहुत उत्साह करतल ध्वनि यहां जनसमूह में बहुत उत्साह द प्राइम मिनिस्टर बींग इंट्रोड्यूस्ड टू द chief of defense staff the three service chiefs and all the other dignitaries here and it's definitely an exciting moment for all the viewers who have specially come here i think for many of them it's the first time a close up view of the people who govern them many of them it's the first time a close up view of the people who govern them the prime minister moving into the two enclosures on either side of the saluting base greeting people making a personal connect and warming the weather the hearts and of course the feelings manni pradhan mantri shri narendra modi vishisht atithi dirgha में केंद्रीय मंत्रिमंडल के सदस्यों वरिष्ठ अधिकारियों राजनयिकों से मिलते हुए उनका अभिवादन स्वीकार करते हुए गृहमंत्री श्री अमित शाह मौजूद साथ में राज्यों के मुख्यमंत्री राज्यपाल विशिष्ट अतिथिगण आज के इस चौहत्तरवें गणतंत्र दिवस समारोह में विशेष तौर पर आमंत्रित किया गया है जिन्हें कुछ ही समय के उपरांत उपराष्ट्रपति महोदय का आगमन होगा कर्तव्य पथ पर जिनका विधिवत स्वागत किया जाएगा माननीय प्रधानमंत्री श्री नरेंद्र मोदी द्वारा और यहां रायसीना पहाड़ी से देश की राष्ट्रपति माननीय श्रीमती द्रौपदी मुर्मू का काफिला धीमे धीमे आगे बढ़ रहा है सधे हुए कदमों से प्रेसिडेंट बॉडीगार्ड्स के ये अश्वारोही दुनिया में अपनी तरह का अनोखा दस्ता गौरवशाली परंपरा और देश प्रेम संकल्प की अनोखी मिसाल भारतीय राष्ट्र राज्य को नई ताकत देने का एहसास राष्ट्रपति अंगरक्षक छियालीस घुड़सवारों का ये दस्ता राष्ट्रपति अंगरक्षकों की रेजिमेंट भारतीय सेना की सबसे पुरानी रेजिमेंट है इस रेजिमेंट की स्थापना सन सत्रह में वॉरन हेस्टिंग्स ने की थी और ये उनकी स्थापना का ढाई सौवा वर्ष है स्वागतम की धुन गूंजती हुई स्वागतम जिसे पंडित नरेंद्र शर्मा ने शब्द दिए और धुन बनाई पंडित रविशंकर ने और कर्तव्य पथ पर सलामी मंच के सामने आगमन हो रहा है भारत के माननीय उपराष्ट्रपति श्री जगदीप धनखड़ का उनका स्वागत किया माननीय प्रधानमंत्री ने 
माननीय उपराष्ट्रपति के साथ उनकी पत्नी श्रीमती सुदेश धनखड़ Swagatam we welcome you with open arms and open hearts and escorting their supreme commander the president's bodyguard approaching the saluting base in their winter ceremonials blue and gold ceremonial turbans long red coats gold girdles white gloves white breeches napoleon boots with spurs Nine feet, nine inch long lances, and red and white cavalry pennants. Along with the chief guest, His Excellency Abdul Fattah Al Sisi, the President of the Arab Republic of Egypt, have arrived. Give your sergeant a man. An arrival at the saluting base of the President of India, Shri Mati Draupadi Murmu. and along with her the honored guest for today's republic day celebrations his excellency abdul fateh al sisi the president of the arab republic of egypt and we warmly welcome them 74 gantantra divas ke mukhya atithi misr ke rashtrapati mahamayim abdul fateh al sisi ka parichay is samay salami manch ke samne maujood teeno sena pramukho aur vishisht अतिथिगणों से कराया जा रहा है रक्षा मंत्री श्री राजनाथ सिंह रक्षा राज्य मंत्री श्री अजय भट्ट माननीय प्रधानमंत्री श्री नरेंद्र मोदी सलामी मंच की ओर प्रस्थान कर रहे हैं देश की सेनाओं की सर्वोच्च कमांडर देश की राष्ट्रपति माननीय श्रीमती द्रौपदी मुर्मू और आज के गणतंत्र दिवस समारोह के मुख्य अतिथि मिस्र के राष्ट्रपति महामहिम अब्दुल फतेह अल सीसी Beyond is now available in your country download the app now get all the news on the move